Hi there, I'm Bethany Amflett, a success manager here at Slack. Today, I'll be discussing how you can leverage Slack to drive additional productivity gains for your customer service agents. Agent productivity is streamlined with the centralized knowledge base that is Slack. Using dedicated hashtag please or hashtag help channels allows agents to search for answers to frequently asked questions, ask their peers for help via channel or huddle, or use pinned resources like Canvas to quickly answer their questions on everything from customer FAQs to internal processes. This leads to many benefits, including greater agent productivity, a dedicated space for company-wide processes, and ultimately gives your agents time back to help customers and drive higher satisfaction. Let's see it in action. In the first example, what you're seeing here is a help channel for customer audits. Not only can an agent post a question or escalate an issue using the bookmarked workflows, but they can also leverage the channel canvas for everything an agent would need to know on the topic. Here you can see this is the channel canvas for this help customer audit channel. Directly tells the agent that they can use a workflow bookmarked in the channel to submit their requests and escalate issues. It also highlights that they can read the FAQs below prior to submitting um, to make sure that it might be a question that's already answered. In addition, um, making it point that having a search first mentality is really key. It, they may have a question that's been asked before, so they can use the search functionality to see if someone has already asked the question. In addition, you can outline your SLAs, um, you can highlight the SMEs who will be responding in the channel, any helpful resources that might be relevant, and again, those FAQs. Once the agent is able to submit their, or maybe they don't find their question is answered in the channel canvas and it hasn't been asked in the past, what they can do is use the workflow at the top to submit their question. They can select an urgency um, saying, I need same day help. Maybe it can wait a little bit longer depending on the need. They can input their question with additional resources if applicable, if there's a link that's needed or anything else and go ahead and submit. Once they submit, one of the channel SMEs can put eyes on it to indicate that they're looking into the question. When they're ready to respond, they can reply in thread and the case is closed. The second example I'd like to demonstrate highlights an approval process managed in Slack. Again, the agent can utilize the channel canvas for more information on the approval process and once ready, can submit the request via the workflow bookmarked in channel. They can indicate who this request is for, describe the request and any additional details that might be helpful, describe the next steps, and submit. From there, the approver can quickly approve or deny the request. You can create another workflow that's triggered when a reaction is used on a post. In this example, once the approved or no entry emojis are placed on the message, the necessary information and next steps will automatically get added to the thread, drastically reducing the time spent on follow-up for the approver. So if the approver goes on to the submission, they can click and select the appropriate reaction. From there, because this is set up with a workflow, it automatically replies in the thread with the next steps. If you'd like to dive deeper into additional line of business use cases for Slack, check out our success hub at slack.com. You'll find more videos like this highlighting department specific use cases, links to events and workshops, guides around specific Slack features, and so much more. Thank you so much for your time today. Thank you.